dear, I forgot the sausage rolls. Oh. <gasps> Hyacinth! <laughs> well, there should be somebody here. There's food on the table. <laughs> of a rather unimaginative variety, it must be said. I think it needs a smidgen of my own cuisine. <laughs> Richard, bring my accoutrements through, will you, dear? <laughs> well, this will be the principal buffet table. Well, I must be getting on, Mrs. Bucket. <laughs> okay. I'll catch you later, Vicar, and fill you in on Sheridan's progress at university. Oh, good. He's doing brilliantly well, you know. Ah. His tutors all forecast astonishing things for him. <laughs> now, just put them down there, dear. They should be quite safe. Now, I'd better try and bring a little style and polish to this food. I shall need some extra people for the unskilled jobs. Receptive people who are willing to watch and learn. Elizabeth, come here, dear. <laughs> While Richard is guarding my china, will you go and round me up a few willing helpers? Uh, what if they won't come, Hyacinth? What do you mean, won't come? Just tell them who it's for, dear. <laughs> Trust you've remembered your cruets, ladies. Oh, you do your lettuce like that, do you? Sort of lumpy and carefree. Yes. <laughs> My Sheridan prefers his arranged rather more symmetrically. But then he has such natural good taste. My mummy, he used to boast, designs the perfect salad. <laughs> A wicked boy, Sheridan. I used to protest, of course, covered with embarrassment, but that's how he was. So perceptive, even at that age. Yes, you need real skill to master cling film, don't you, dear? <laughs> oh, yes, he always had good taste, even as quite a small child. When other boys would come home from school looking as though they'd barely survived an explosion, my Sheridan would always have his tie on straight and the cleanest pair of knees in the civilised world. <laughs> oh, is that one of Mrs Watson's cakes? Oh, yes, I can see it is now. <laughs> she does try, bless her. <laughs> That's one of Sheridan's favourite cakes, when it's made properly. <laughs> Not that he has a sweet tooth, he's very self-disciplined. Oh, I remember his scoutmaster used to say that he'd never known anyone apply more grit and determination to the acquisition of his cook's badge than Sheridan. <laughs> oh, that's nice, dear. Whatever it is. 